Hello and welcome to Mr Ridley's Design and Technology. In this clip we're going to look at a GCSE type question and this question is based on two point perspective drawing. So the question here says um, figure four shows an orthographic drawing of a dowel joint. In the space below complete the two point perspective drawing during the dowel joint. And there's a little picture there of a dowel and if we move down to here and we can see here is the um, orthographic drawing of the assembled um, dowel joint. So the orthographic drawing has a plan view, that's the top view, has a front view there and has a side view. What you have to do is we've got this line here to help you start and we've got two VP vanishing points. So it's a four mark question. If we take a look at this, here's the completed um, joint. So we can see there, there's our three views and then there's our um, two point perspective drawing so we've got two points there, two vanishing points with all the lines so all the lines from here either go across to there or over to here and that's that's basically the four mark you'd probably get um, a couple of marks for each of these kind of areas which would be your four marks so in the DT exam it's always useful to have a ruler, a pencil a um, rubber and probably a fine liner as well. I'm going to do this in pencil, you should be able to see it. So we're going to start off and we start with our ruler and we just line it from the bottom of that line up to the vanishing point. I'm going to go here, so we put the ruler on there, bring it round to match the two points and down to here. There we come across, go from this point here Having this starting line makes it a lot easier, makes the question a lot easier. Without the starting line it would be difficult. So there's the first stage. Now we need to add this detail for the wood joint. So if we just, I'm not going to measure anything, I'm just going to draw this. Let's say it's a four mark question, so it should take you about four minutes. I can then go from this line, so I need this, this line across here, for the top of the piece of wood. So I can go here and come across, I'm drawing this slightly heavier than I would have done, would do normally. Um, so we can see there's that, that piece of wood. I can then go along here, draw a line down. Remember to keeping any lines that aren't going to the vanishing points need to be absolutely vertical. Then I've got this line across here for the end of the front piece of wood. So I'm lining up with this point here, back to my vanishing point there. Now this piece of wood is drawn. Then I can I could measure this distance here, but I'm just going to guesstimate it at about there. I don't think you'd lose marks for that kind of inaccuracy. And then again, I can pick a thickness. So if I say that's the same distance there for thickness, and can go from there to my vanishing point up to there. Then I need to add this top piece here. So I take this point here up to the vanishing point and just draw that in. Um, then the last um, part obviously as you can see here we've got the the two dowels because they'd be drawn in they'd be those those dowels there and we just I just freehand draw those in and then the two dowels. Um, you can just line in which is just going over the drawing again just so that it's clear. You could possibly now rub out these other lines but I wouldn't do that because it kind of shows how you know you some of the marks might be allocated for the vanishing point um, drawing. So there, there's your completed drawing and as I say it's four marks so it should take you four minutes which it's taken me just about that and then um, that's it. So there's the completed two point perspective drawing of the dowel joint for GCSE Design and Technology. Thank you for watching Mr Ridley's Design and Technology.